Hi. So many times you can see this type of error like a server error in an application or something related to this. You are running a file, you're getting this kind of error. So this is kind of invalid operation exception. Uh, it means what happened, a file you are trying to access from your browser that is not exist in your folder, in your views folder. So if you look at the error is already explained properly. Uh, that that's it's it is looking for an index or or its master that is not available in your folders so that is looking for a location so which locations is looking is a views folder uh, under views uh, default folder and then it's looking for index.aspx cx px acx cshtml vbhtml cshtml all kind of extens extension that that default uh, like setting up in, in in their system to look for they are looking but uh, they doesn't find anything related to index so why is looking for index first we have to identify that and and then then we can go with the conclusion why this is happening so first thing is like you can see we have two actions over here one is index one is test so we we must have two different files uh, inside that default folder so let's go uh, when you go to the views folder, see, you will you will find like there is only one test CSSTML. There is no index CSSTML. First problem you can identify here, like you have to create an index CSSTML if you are accessing. But suppose there is another issue, like if if you are not actually want to use this index or HTML as a main page, you want to use a test as a main page so it means there is a problem with 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 something from a routing system so you you have to navigate to your uh, app start uh, root config okay once you do this you will find like what is setting up here so you will see like a default controller a con the, the current defaults are the controller name default and the action is index so if if you if you want to load index first then you have to create a file over here index.cshtml first solution if 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 you are looking to run the index file first but if you if you don't want to use index as an action over here so you can just remove this guy from here this this index dot as uh, index action and then then navigate to this uh, routing method and go change it to test okay I'm going to try this guy first, like uh, how this is happening. So you will see, like I, I am not uh, currently looking for index.cshtml. I'm just running my main page as a test.cshtml. So let's see. So it's something is uh, being loaded. Yet. Okay. Okay, so you see like a test page is working and there is uh, it's taking a default URL, so it's not index. So what happen if you want to use index, but but and it's uh, you want to add over here because uh, you want to use index. Let's 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 go here and and then uh, change it back to the index. So what is our uh, our our requirement is to add index page as a front end that was not added. So we have to add that. So let's go for views. MBC five.
okay you just have to go view page change it back to the index So this is something we just started uh, looking into. We just have index page. I can put a h1 tag over here. Index. So if you see like now uh, when when we change it back to uh, like it's accessing now index default and index let's see uh, it's working or not the error is, error is gone or not so this this uh, application uh, error you can fix uh, two ways if it's uh, you have to add that file you haven't added you uh, your requirement says yeah you have to add that page you you will navigate to just navigate to the views folder find out the controller folder and then add that file that is missing into that folder and if you are looking to change into the like you change unexpectedly like you want to change that action name url uh, things so you just have to go back to the system uh, go, go go back to that folder and and change the routing and all the things so you don't have to worry about the file name there is two different ways to fix that another way to like you can uh, without changing into the uh, routing you can just add multiple actions and then create these files into that folder so it's almost ready and you can see like its index is coming and, and, and it's properly working so this is way uh, to do that like a uh, fix this thing so these these things are already associated this index is uh, connected with this index and this test this test connected with this test file so this is how mbc uh, controller connected with the views here to here you see default controller default folder index index test test okay that's from my side thank you so much